Firstly, come to West Coast and was a development coach of the backline uh, under John Westfold. So did that for a few years and then got the job and got the go-ahead to be the line coach of the backline. So travel with the side every week and that was a really good experience to do that for three years and then went into the role of contested ball coordinator. So helping coordinate drills with coaches and Simo to help us to be the best we can be at contested ball. Just was hard work to coach because you, you can't play handball games all the time and you know, you've got to look after bo bodies physically within the players. Um, and we've got skill, we've got team defence, so we use um, bags and roll balls to the players. It's using handball games, doing handball games for five minutes. But overall, it's a lot about mindset as well. Any technical deficiencies within players, if they don't use their hip you know, well enough to protect themselves, we'll teach them that. But overall, it's about continuity and then when games come around, they, they you know, put it into games, put it into action. If I could put myself in players' shoes and, and try to feel how they're feeling and how they're thinking, uh, that helps uh, myself uh, educate and develop the players in the right areas that we feel as a coaching group need. There's no one worth a spray. It's about understanding the individual player. Oh, Hick thrives on, on that role with uh, relationship with the players but also challenging him. He's very, very good at that role but not only that, he challenges the coaches and, and tries to get the best out of us with what we're doing with our players. So Hick's embraced the role as we know he has but uh, he's been very good for others around him. When I first retired from playing, David Parkin was had an influence on my coaching. I suppose uh, to always be myself, um, try not to coach like others, so that was really important for me. Um, moving on to uh, John Westfold um, when I come to West Coast and now Adam Simpson. So the head coaches I've been under pay a fair bit of attention to in the way the delivering messages, um, understanding the game itself um, and the research you do on opposition and getting the best out of your own players. Um, so caring for them off field and on field is really important. So there's three names that have influenced our coach.